Welcome back everyone to another BD Outdoor Sport Boat Roundup. Compared to last week, that bluefin bite, it definitely slowed down a little bit with lower bluefin counts in the last couple days, but there's quality out there, no question. With a lot of these finicky bluefin within 60 miles and the bite not yet wide open, you really want to fish as light as you can get away with during the day. And that bait selection is key with those smaller size two circle hooks. Smaller hooks, best bait you can find, getting that bait to go down, out and away from the boat. That's gonna be your best bet during the daytime when bluefin are around and you're fly lining a bait. With those bigger models, you always wanna have that sinker rig set up just in case during the day. Although getting a bite might be tough right now, you really have to put in the time to get rewarded. So some boats to mention, the PQ coming in with 20 bluefin, 80 to 180 pounds on their two day. Pegasus was 16 in that similar range on their day and a half. Polaris Supreme, 14 bluefin, little slow spirit of adventure coming back from their first trip of the season with some bigger models the legend with 25 bluefin pacific voyager with 27 plus some yellowtail calicos and some rockfish with bluefin creeping in closer to home they're anywhere from 20 to around 180 so it's one of those things where you either want to bite or they're going to make you work for it and making sure you're adjusting your tackle on the lighter side or the heavier side based off of how they're behaving like i was explaining earlier is going to be the ticket there it's pretty clear the bluefin bite has slowed across the board with some accounts biting those bigger longer jigs right now but it's almost a matter of time before things start heating up again a lot of bonita coming off the full day fleet with sign of bluefin that don't really want to play yet. San Nicolas Island this weekend had cold water around 58 degrees. Not a lot of sign of yellowtail, but there was good halibut fishing. El Dorado had limits of reds and sheephead Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. There's also good fishing on whitefish and rockfish as well. San Clemente had good weather this week with fun calico bass fishing, sheephead, rockfish, bonito, yellowtail, halibut, white sea bass. The water was around 60 degrees on the back and 62 degrees on the front end. So we'll see what this weekend holds. Until then, I'll check in with you guys next time.